What is up you guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel or if it's your first time here, welcome. So today I have a bikini haul for you. I'm going to be trying on and reviewing a brand that most of you probably haven't heard of. It is a small female owned and operated brand called Mama. What I love about this brand is they are sustainable. I absolutely love that more brands are heading in that direction. That is what our planet needs. And another thing that I really like about this brand is they anticipate intentionally designed their suits to be more than just swimsuits. Um, they want it to be like swimwear that you can live in. Um, so not stuff that you just can swim in, stuff that you can lounge in, um, whereas like a little going out top, sleep in, go to the gym in, all of the above. So I love that. I love the focus on versatility. You guys know that I love my athleisure. So I guess this is swim leisure if you will. <laughs> so before we get started with the haul, as usual, everything that I talk about in this video will be listed in the description box down below, along with my sizes and the colors I got of everything. I will also have all of my personal links, discount codes, and measurements for reference down there as well. I did want to let you know that Mama did give me a discount code to share with you. It is Shannon20. So I'll put that right here and in the description box, and that will get you 20% off of your purchase. So with that being said, let's hop in to it. So the first suit that I have on is the Roxanne crop top and the Riley Joe bottoms. I'm wearing the top in a size large and the bottoms in a size medium. So as you can see, the top is a short sleeve crop top and it is like a mock neck. It has a zipper in the back as well and it's made from a super soft, stretchy swimsuit material. It's made from recycled nylon and spandex and it feels very high quality. It does not have any padding or anything in here, um, but I do feel supported in it. I feel like if you wanted a little bit more support, you could easily wear a swimsuit underneath of it um, it would definitely just like go over a regular swimsuit and this is definitely a top that I feel like would be for water sports and activities like if you went surfing boogie boarding or tubing or just like water sports in general um, because it does cover your entire chest um, so you wouldn't have to worry about like anything popping out you know what I mean and it obviously gives you a little bit more coverage if you're someone that like wants to cover up this area. Personally, obviously, if I was like just like going out for the intention of tanning, I probably would not wear this top, but I definitely do think that it would be good for water sports. Or if you got like super sunburnt one day um, and then you wanted to like cover up your sunburn the next day, that's definitely happened to me on vacation before. Um, so you still wanna be like playing in the water or something, you know, this could be a good option for that. And I did want to touch on sizing really quickly. I definitely think that this top runs small. I got it in a large and it fits me in a large. Um, swimsuit sizing is hard, you guys. Swimsuit sizing is very hard. It always depends on the brand and it depends on the structure of the suit. Um, so I, in some brands, I wear a small, some brands I wear a medium, and some brands I wear a large. Like swimsuit sizing is so difficult. And in this haul, I have some sizes small, medium, and large. Um, but this top definitely runs small because I have it on in a large. And then the Riley Joe bottoms. These are a high rise bottom. Um, they definitely have good coverage on the side. They don't like come up like you know, and show too much on the side here. And they are cheeky, but they definitely provide like a decent amount of coverage on like the upper portion of your booty and your lower back. Um, personally, I actually love the fit of these. I think the fit is super flattering. They do not dig into my sides. I'm super picky about swimsuit bottoms very picky about swimsuit bottoms actually. I absolutely hate it when swimsuits dig in to my sides and they don't do that. I still would say if you are in between sizes on these, I would size up. Um, personally, like with swimsuits, I always say if you're in between sizes, you might as well size up. I would always rather have a swimsuit fit me a little bit too big rather than a little bit too small because I just hate feeling like I'm gonna spill out of a swimsuit or like it digs into my sides. It just makes me feel uncomfortable. So that is what I would do. Um, but yeah, I love these bottoms. I don't feel like they're gonna slip out of place. I don't feel like I'm gonna like, you know, things are gonna be moving <laughs> down here. So this in general would be a great suit for just like 
water sports. Um, but yeah, love these bottoms. This top, I probably would only wear if I was, you know, gonna be a sporty gal. Up next, we have the Maya racer top and the Fonda bottoms. And I'm wearing both of these in a size medium in the color Moss. So first of all, absolutely love this color. Green is one of my favorite colors. And like just like earth tones in general, I always gravitate towards earth tones. Um, so the top obviously is high neck and it is racer back. It does not have any padding, which some people feel strongly about that. I don't really care if a top doesn't have padding or not. As long as it's not see-through, I don't really mind. I will say it is very comfortable, but there is definitely a bit of just a bit of side boob going on here. So nothing crazy, but enough that I probably wouldn't wanna do um, like beach activities or like water sports in this, um, just because, you know, you just never know. It's definitely just like not as supportive as the last top. It is super cute, especially if you wanted to cover your chest, cover the girls a little bit more, um, but yeah, definitely not um, super supportive. And then these bottoms are a very similar style to the last bottoms um, with like the band at the top. Uh, but these ones are definitely a bit more of a thong bottom. They definitely are a bit cheekier. I will say, I do think I prefer the black ones. I feel like the green ones are squeezing me a little bit. I feel like they might run a little small. I think I would have liked these better in a large, just because like I said, I don't really like being squeezed um, anywhere, but especially like on my waist. Um, and I think the reason for the squeezing is these ones have like the same looking kind of like band at the top, but this band is seamless whereas this band um, it has a like elastic in it which definitely like helps it stay in place but I prefer a seamless band if you watch my activewear reviews you probably know love a seamless waistband um, so I would definitely say out of the two of these I do prefer the black ones even though they provide a little more coverage and you guys know I'm all about my cheeky stuff I still prefer the black ones. Up next, we have the Kahlo Lounge Top and the Juliet Bottoms, both in a size medium in the color Ivory. So this suit and the next suit, I absolutely love. So the top fits kind of like a bra um, because it is straight up and down and it has adjustable straps. Again, it doesn't have padding, but it's not see-through, so I don't really mind. I feel like it makes the girls look great, kind of perks them up a bit. It is so freaking comfortable. I don't know about you. Um, I've talked about this in videos before. I talk about this with um, sports bras, but wearing racer back stuff for too long sometimes really hurts my traps. So I love having um, sports bras and bikini tops that aren't racer back that distribute the weight just a little bit differently um, because sometimes on vacation, if I wear a like, you know, like tie top or racer back bikini top every single day, my traps are like, girl, like, please take that off. Um, so I really do like having options like this. Um, yeah, love this top, I think it's so cute. And then these bottoms, I also absolutely love. First of all, I love a side tie bottom and I love a thick side tie bottom because they're adjustable. And like I said, I'm so picky about the way bottoms fit and I hate when they dig into my sides. So adjustable bottoms are just like it for me because if I am feeling a little thicker one day or smaller the next day, I can adjust how they fit. And you can adjust where you like, where you wear them on your hips. You can wear them lower rise, you can wear them high rise. Obviously I am a high rise kind of girl, so that's where I choose to wear them. And the other thing that I love about bottoms like these is they're not like crazy high rise, but high enough that you don't feel like, you know, they're not like an itty bitty bikini. And then these are quite cheeky in the back, which as we know, cheeky is my jam. Um, so I love this suit. And the white too gives me like bachelorette party vibes. Obviously I am not anywhere close to being married. Um, <laughs> but if you are a bachelorette and you're looking for a white bikini, literally every single one of these bikinis is offered in all of the colors that I'm showing you. So if you like one more than the other, um, and if you are a bachelorette, all of these bikinis are offered in this white color. Um, but I feel like this one, 
is a winner. Okay, and then the last suit we have is the Tara tie-up top and the Delilah bottoms, and I got both of these in a size small in the color chocolate. So like I said, the last suit and this suit, definitely my favorites in the haul, of course. Very me, I think. So this is your standard um, like tie kind of triangle top and string bikini bottom. So again, the top does not have any cut pads in it. Um, one thing about this triangle top is it doesn't just like end in a triangle right here and then go into a string. It kind of like goes thinner up here. So I feel like it provides just a little bit more support than a standard triangle top. Um, and of course, a self tie up here and down here. I definitely think it makes the girls look good. And then the bottoms, as I said, I love a side tie bottom. These also provide a decent amount of coverage in the front and they come up like decently high. I feel like a lot of little like string bikini bottoms are so tiny right here. And sometimes it's cool, sometimes it's cool, but depending on the vibe, depending on the time of month, depending on a lot of different factors, you know, we're ladies here, depending on a lot of different factors, um, you just might not wanna wear like a micro little bottom here. So I like that this provides a little more coverage here and up here. And then in the back, it is definitely a song, teeny tiny, like very minimal coverage, which I personally love. I know that's not for everyone, but I love it. This would be a perfect suit for tanning, very minimal tan lines in this suit. I also absolutely love the chocolate brown color. I feel like brown has really like made an entrance this year in fashion. Um, I don't know why people were sleeping on it before. Like I said, I love my earth tones, um, but I feel like brown is like it right now. Like I'm seeing brown everywhere and I'm here for it because it's a neutral earth tone. I really, really like it. And then as far as sizing goes, like I said, I got both of these in a size small, um, which I usually would not do in a like string bikini. I usually don't do smalls in those. So I definitely would say this runs a little bit big. So if you are in between sizes, I would size down in this suit. So that is it, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Again, my mama discount code is Shannon20. I did also want to mention something really cool. They plant a tree for every order. So not only are you ordering sustainable swimwear made from recycled materials, but they they plant a tree for every order that you make, which I think is super, super cool. So obviously pricing for sustainable items is a little bit higher. Obviously it's gonna be less with my um, discount code, but pricing for sustainable items is a little bit higher because it is more expensive to make things from recycled materials. Unfortunately, of course it's like that, but you're paying for something that is sustainable. You're paying for a small female owned business. And I feel like the swimwear feels like it's really high quality. So there you have it. That is my review. Thank Thanks again for watching and I will catch you next time guys.